Alert for you tonight. Wildlife experts want you to be aware of the dangers of bird flu as cases rise across the Commonwealth. According to the Department of Wildlife Resources, the cause is likely due to birds traveling north during the spring months. 8 News reporter Sahara Sri Raman joins us live now in the Digital Center. Sahara, what do people need to know about these contagious cases? Roland, right now the likelihood of humans getting infected by bird flu is low. But as different species start to see the effects of this contagious disease, health officials want more people to be aware that this could change. We wanted to make everyone aware of what was going on in the landscape, uh, you know, why there might be dead birds found uh, on the beach, and then, and then also so that bird owners could heighten their biosecurity practices. This message from wildlife expert John Tracy after the Department of Wildlife Resources saw an increase in reports of dead or sick birds. The trend points to avian influenza or bird flu as the likely cause. According to the CDC, this contagious disease started in 2020. Over the years, as cases increased, the U.S. Department of Agriculture says the likelihood that the virus could start infecting humans increased as well. While bird flu cases in humans is not common, for the first time dairy cows are being infected, shocking experts who previously thought they weren't vulnerable. According to the Virginia Department of Wildlife Resources, a majority of bird cases are reported in shore and water birds, but wild birds and commercial bird flocks have also been impacted. Tracy says domestic animals have not been affected and monitoring bird populations will help stop the spread. The virus lives sort of normally in waterfowl, uh, and so ducks and, and geese can carry this and not show any clinical signs, but can spread it. He warns people who are in frequent contact with poultry to wear separate clothes when handling birds and to alert the department if anyone finds dead birds, especially in a group. We may or may not see um, mortality events, but it's important for us to be aware of what's happening, both from a wild bird standpoint, but also bird owners and, and the commercial poultry industry. Again, the risk of bird flu infecting humans is rare. If this happens to you, the CDC asks you to isolate yourself and contact your local health department. Live from the Digital Center, Sahara Sri Raman, 8 News.